Alright, welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a catch and cook. In my last video I said I was going to be doing the dove catch and cook, so that's what we're doing today. Got my pellet gun, and we're going to go after some doves, see if we can get some. Alright guys, we got a dove on the wire. I'm going to take a shot at him, see if we get him. Here we go, taking the shot. We hit him. Alright, I hit that dove low. He landed right there in the tree, and there's about three more that landed in there with him. So I think I see one on the barn, on the top of the barn too. We're gonna go after him, see if we can get him down. Well, all the doves got away in time before we can get a shot off them, so we're gonna have to try to find some more. All right, guys. So we're, we didn't get doves this time, but I just got two pigeons in the silo. The pellet gun. I was laying right here and shooting straight up. I got one. I think it was this one. Looks, I think I hit him right in the neck. He fell right down. And then I shot at the other one like five times and I missed him every time. And he just flew around in here and then landed again so I keep shooting at him. And I was laying, I was, I was laying right there again and I was, I was holding the gun upside down so I was looking at this like that at the pigeon and I shot him upside down. And he dropped just like the other one. Oh yeah, there's where I hit him, right there. Good shot. See if we can get some doves, maybe. Alright, we got a dove on the wire, all the way over there. We're gonna walk up to it, see if we get him. Maybe I'll just name this video a pigeon catch and cook instead of dove. Because we might not be getting any doves today, but at least we got some pigeons to eat. And the doves flew away again, just like all the others. Don't move, don't move. Gotta be kidding me! All right, we're gonna go ahead and start cleaning these pigeons. We're not gonna eat them tonight. We'll probably eat them tomorrow. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to clean these. So just start plucking all the feathers off. You don't have to get every single one. Just get as get a decent amount of them off. And on a dove, normally you can just push that skin down, but on a pigeon, it's a lot tougher. So. Got to get a knife and cut that skin like that. Then you can just start peeling it back. And now you can see all that nice breast meat right there. That's the main part of the meat. We're going to get out of the pigeon. And you can see where we shot it to right there. Went right through the breast. But some people, I know most people like to get their thumb under here and then just pull the whole thing out. I've tried that before and I don't really like it because it just makes a big mess and all the bones get mixed up in the meat. So what I usually do on a dove and pigeon is get my knife and flay the breast right off. Just like that, try to get as much meat as possible. There we go, got a nice flay right there. Go ahead and get the other one. There we go, got the other flay. And we're also going to get the hearts out of these pigeons, so once you flay them, you just pull the, the bone up, just like that, and it, you can see everything down in there. The, hearts, the heart is right there, so we're going to go ahead and cut that out. And there's the heart right there. So this pigeon's all done, and when you're done with things, throw it out in the field like that. And we'll go ahead and get the other ones cleaned up. Alright, we got all the pigeon cleaned up and ready to eat tomorrow. So we'll go ahead and see you tomorrow when we're cooking up the pigeon. Alright, it's the next day and we're going to cook up the pigeons. And Jake's brought a whole bunch of dove to cook up. We're going to be cooking on the grill today. Got a skeleton in there. We didn't have any foil. So we got the pigeon from yesterday in the bag right here. Put some flour in it, and some garlic salt, some garlic powder, and some blackened seasoning, and got some onion powder. Go ahead and close it up and shake it. All right there we go. Got get some whole bunch of butter. Throw it in there. All right, we got the pigeon. I'm gonna throw it in there. It's a heart. We'll need to add some more butter. 
Make sure those things are frying up good. Jake putting his dove in. Shot some today. About 20 minutes ago. Yeah. Nice and fresh. About as fresh as it gets. And some dove from our last hunting video. Opening day hunting. Make sure to check that video out. Mm. Got them all in there. We just gotta wait a couple minutes till they're done and ready to eat. It's time to flip them. Looking good so far. Oh yeah, they're getting Yeah. I, they all should be ready. We'll go ahead and start taking them out. Last one. Mm -hmm. That's so mm, I want that piece. There they all are. We'll go ahead and start eating them. See what they taste like. Gotta have them with A1. Makes it taste like a juicy steak. First bite of the dove. Mm, pretty good. Sweet. What's it taste like? Steak. Good. Mm, good. First time. Awesome. Would you want some? <laughs> What's it taste like, Wade? Steak. Yeah. All right, I'm going to try some here. I got, this is all the pigeon, and they should be trying the dove right now. I'll go try the pigeon and see what it tastes like. All right, here's a pigeon heart. See what it tastes like. Mmm, that's really tender. All right, here's the pigeon breast. really tender also the heart is a little bit more tender but it got about the same flavor it does taste a lot like a steak but it has a gamey flavor in it but it's it's it doesn't make it taste bad or anything it just has like minerally flavor in it this dove and pigeon meat if you didn't know already it has a red meat um it's not like chicken it's more like a steak I think dove's be better than pigeon. Yeah, we all think dove tastes better than the pigeon. It's a little bit more tender. It melts in your mouth a lot more than the pigeon. Pigeon's a little bit more chewy. It's still good, really good though. Really tasty. See what Libby thinks of it. Libby, is it good? Libby likes it. Went ahead and cooked the rest of the dove. That's it for this video guys, thanks for watching. If you're interested in seeing that dove hunting video, I'll go ahead and post the link in the description. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe and I'll see you later.